We continue to follow and update the breaking news we've been telling you about. Several students in need of medical attention after police say a classmate deliberately pricked them with a lancet in school. WJC is live in Harford County. George Solis explains the frightening incident took place at Falston High School. George. Yeah, good evening, Vic. This is a fluid and developing situation. As you mentioned, this happened at Falston High School, where Harford County uh, Sheriff's Office says 17 students, at least 17 students, were pricked by this blood lancet. Now, for those that don't know, a blood lancet is a device typically used by diabetics to prick their finger for a small blood sample. Now, the school is saying that they immediately notified parents and asked them to take their children who were affected to their local doctors. Now, moments ago, WJZ speaking to one of those students affected and their family about this harrowing incident. Here's what they had to say. So he kind of just came up to me and pricked me with it. And then, but, uh, I didn't really know what was happening at first until I got called down to the office. And then that's when I realized that it was, it was kind of, it wasn't really going to be a good thing. I'm scared for him, scared for the others. Uh, you know, I don't necessarily know if the student knew exactly what the consequences would be of his actions. Um, <laughs> You know, but with everyone affected and and whatever wherever he got this from, wherever it originated from, you know, just just concerned with what could be contaminated on the needle. Now, Jonathan Schiller, the student who you heard from there, says that his classmate, the 15-year-old, obtained that blood lancet from his grandfather, who is a diabetic. And again, Harford County Sheriff's Office saying that at least 17 students were pricked by this device. All of them checked out by the nurse. And again, they are urging any parent who has a student in this condition to be checked out by their local doctors. Now, the school also issuing a statement, again, saying that they did notify the parents. And of course, if any of these students uh, were involved in any sporting event tonight that maybe they should consider going to the doctor instead and again this is a developing situation 17 at least 17 students pricked by this uh, blood lancet here in Hartford County we will be uh, following the story tonight and bring you updates as they become available for now we're live in Hartford County George Solis WJZ Eyewitness News George thank you and of course we will have much more on this story coming up tonight on Eyewitness News at 11.